In Chapter 23, Holden Caulfield returns to Mr. Antolini's apartment after leaving Phoebe. Holden interacts affectionately with Mrs. Antolini, stroking her hair while they talk. Mr. Antolini asks about Holden's expulsion, showing a friendly, non-judgmental interest in his life. His manner makes Holden feel comfortable, and they engage in a deep conversation about life and the meaning of success. Holden narrates that Mr. Bro, Antolini had been his English teacher at Elkton Hills and had a profound effect on his life. Mr. Antolini questions Holden about his plans for the future and whether he has given thought to his prospects. Mr. Antolini warns him about heading for a fall and expresses his concern about Holden's lack of direction. He offers a quote from the psychoanalyst Wilhelm Steckel. The mark of the immature man is that he wants to die nobly for a cause, while the mark of the mature man is that he wants to live humbly for one. He encourages Holden to find a cause and live humbly for it, rather than mindlessly following a crowd or treading a path of self-destruction. This conversation leads Holden to consider Mr. Antolini as a mentor, not just a teacher. Tired from their discussion and feeling unwell, Holden accepts Mr. Antolini's offer to stay overnight. Mrs. Antolini prepares a bed for him, and he quickly falls asleep. The chapter ends, setting the stage for the controversial event in the next chapter, where Mr. Antolini's inappropriate behavior will leave Holden feeling betrayed. Overall, this chapter reveals the deep concern Mr. Antolini has for Holden and highlights his role as one of the few adults in the novel who attempts to guide and support the troubled teenager. His advice reflects the central theme of the novel, the struggle between the innocence of childhood and the responsibility of adulthood.